something that makes life better. I know that they have to be creative and smart to be able to put things together and actually do something that helps the, the community. We teach them in class that Engineering is part of their daily lives, whether they're interested in it or not. Um, but that's something that they should have an awareness of, especially heading into the 21st century, that engineering and STEM education is really a big part of their lives, whether it's a path they choose or not. I think it's really important to get these kids uh, still hooked on the STEM, the science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. You know, it's amazing that these guys are doing this at such a young age. Um, I barely got into this in high school, and these kids are already getting a head start. Alex is talking about wanting to do gears, David's saying he wants to do robotics, electronic stuff, so I mean just for these guys to know what they want already and help them find their passion and just keep them hooked on this stuff, it's, it's great. And, and, and the excitement is working side by side with, a, with an engineer. Um, so they can learn what that engineer does on a daily basis and what the day in life of an engineer is, but also those engineers can interact with the students on what they're doing in their classrooms to help them prepare to be successful in, in high school and post-secondary and beyond. We're giving these kids a little more of an understanding, I think, of what uh, engineering is and can be. I mean, it, it's it's not just sitting in a uh, in a cube or in a test cell working on something specific. It's what they've seen a lot through working. It's a lot of systems that have to come together. It's just kind of give these guys an experience of, of how that is, how that goes, how that process works. Uh, just kind of share that experience and hopefully keep them excited and uh, and pushing forward with their engineering. And hopefully when they go back to their classroom, they just are excited about the opportunity they had here and then excited about uh, engineering and becoming uh, that as a profession possibly in, the, in their future. It's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. All the different shapes and everything that go into it and all the different pieces we put on. It looks awesome. I think it's pretty awesome. I, I'm kind of surprised to see that they desized it to make it even a smaller mouth. I mean, look at this thing. It takes up a whole table. That's something you do every day. Definitely not. This is Kenny Orrell reporting for Brick World 2012. Yeah. See you next year. Yeah.